Alrighty, I am going to roast Trim Trim. I like, I sometimes watch Trim Trim pranks, so. I didn't say life hacks, I said pranks. Where is it? So, huh? Prank. Okay, we got. Prank Wars, I guess. Prank. Hmm. I don't really care which one, but we're going to find something. Okay, let's do this. 15 funny pranks, okay. Okay, um. Run the world. Okay. Who is this she's brought to the isolated cozy place on the beach? Her new friend? Did she bring a strange girl to the secret place I showed to her? I can't leave it like this. She's going to regret it. I First of all, why would you even show your best friend? A special place that you want to keep secret to everyone else? Of course she's going to show it to somewhere else. Someone else. What do you expect? Okay. First of all, you have to stain her clothes too. Because it would be stained on the clothes. It would be already seeking into her clothes. You have to make it at least wet. Make it a little bit look like... Like, sh she actually spilt it. In a cup. Add pink coloring. Mix well. If you like Trim Trim, leave this video right now. I'm going to roast it all. Pour the remains over a plastic mask. Okay. Place the cover slant, letting the glue flow down. Place the top and the drinking straw in the glue. Let it dry. When the glue hardens, it will fasten all the details together. Okay, she's coming. She sees the spilled cocktail. Why would, would, would anyone do this, to be honest? You're smarter than that. You can just yell at them and they won't come back. And if you're really mad at them, you can, um, you're gonna shoot them. Yeah, um, yeah, well, um. She'll hardly be able to use her beach towel today. Fold it several times. This is cruel. <laughs> what happens if she, she um tries to unfold it? Uh, what do you think she's going to do? She might just uh, put it on fire, and then you have to explain. Oh, I just sewed it together. Yeah. Yay. Yay, I like creatures. Perfect. I love this. <laughs> Be 
because it's so unrealistic like um yep if i was her friend first of all i need glasses so i kind of have no choice so i can't put them in my pocket where in the world is my glasses we got this oh it's over there no i did and second of all wouldn't you feel the hard uncomfortable end of it coming out of your shorts <laughs> i would totally do <laughs> yeah and they freak out so like so fake they're like um for <laughs> who brings mascara to a to a pl with your f while you're hanging out with your friend that's a real question Okay. She puts little worms in it. They're of course not the real. Will do perfectly well. Tear off to be honest, I would be terrified. <laughs> <laughs> this is one prank that I actually would be terrified. Imagine like biting into a peach and then just feel wiggly things in your mouth. You would have a heart attack then, right then and there. Okay. Paint it with a food marker to transform the marshmallow into a worm. It, they were wow. already trying. We've got a whole crawling army. There are enough worms for a few fruit pieces. To pit a big apricot, break it on one side. Use a big paper clip to remove the pit. Stuff the fruit with cute fake creatures. Place the remaining worms in a box and take it with you to snack on if you get hungry. <laughs> Perfect. She's got two identical looking she keeps the plain fruit for herself and gives the special one to my friend. Of course. She takes it willingly as it's her favorite fruit. Yay. She finds the worms on the second bite. Oh, God. Ugh. What ghastly worms. I've never seen such huge ones. If my old friends got a new... How was she not terrified? <laughs> yelling and screaming and probably throwing up only if i um buy into it and it tastes like marshmallow i probably would punch him in the face uh mixed feelings i'll do the same here's a girl trying to take a selfie i'll get acquainted with her i help her take a few shots she agrees to help me in return she's fond of pranking as well i'll put yeah. a very special makeup on her face um, so, you're going to a random person, asking if to, um, take pictures to put up, um, horrible makeup on their face, and they're like, sure, I'm probably gonna be the person that does that, but still, I'm, I'm the weirdo in this situation, no one else is gonna do this, I'm sorry, especially he trying to look fabulous. Let me guess it's waterproof. She can terrify or something. With this awesome makeup. The girls are relaxed. So Please tell me it's not waterproof. Feet. My new acquaintance swims to them under the water. Suddenly oh. she comes up yelling, her head covered with seaweed. The girls scream terrified, and I watch the action from the shore. I like to scare As my little self, I probably wouldn't run terrified. I probably would get a uh, um, stick or something and start whacking it until it says, I, I find I'm just doing this as a prank. Stop! Yeah, that's what I would do. So. so funny when frightened. This time, a mysterious hand will try to grab them from the sand. I'll have to work hard. I'll need to dig a hole in the sand to hide my assistant in. It's enough, I suppose. She lies down, and I have to cover her with the sand. 
purposely decide to cut her up. I cover her with the beach towel like a blanket. To hide her head, I put the bag next to it. And cover with a towel. Perfect. She's absolutely invisible. The girls come back after swimming and lie down to sunbathe. They feel no danger. All of a sudden, an eerie hand appears from under the sand. The reaction is instant. They run away here. The thing is, first of all, if I was really scared, I would be jolting. And second of all, uh, I wouldn't, when I'm scared, I don't run. I freeze and, in, in, um, death, I'm like, this is how I'm going to die. Okay, time to do this. I was on this ride that made you fall towards the ground and I almost puked doing that but after i got off i was like let me do another <laughs> i love roller coasters oh the silly girls have gone to the sea i think when you swim away they can't hide from me okay i'll let them relax i'm not gonna scare them anymore i've made special mascara for my friend i'm sure okay. she'll ask for it i heard she's going to the beach again but doesn't take me replace waterproof mascara for regular she asks for my waterproof mascara, as I expected. Here it is. Take it. She won't guess the makeup is non-waterproof. I want to see it now. She comes out of the water. Her hair is wet, so she's been diving a lot. And, as the result, the mascara smudged all over her face. People around keep staring at her, but she thinks she's dark. Are you an idiot? First of all... Who would wear er uh, makeup anywhere? I only see Oh no uh, <laughs> if you're not if you're not gonna go to the um to the um what was it? If you're not going to oop put the effort to put on um lipstick, why put on mascara? You need both to actually look good. looking at lipstick mascara and cutting headphones to make it I am done I am full